Well, hello and welcome to Eco Farm. This is episode nine, and this is a bit of a what's well, a fairly short episode, and also a couple of things that need to be done, and a couple of corrections of mistakes, and then just an explanation of a huge mistake at the end. In any event, to start off with, we're going to finish off our greenhouses, so they're busy operating very very nicely but there is another step in this greenhouse process and that's with the waste that we get from the greenhouses we can actually make compost so we're going to start by building the compost heap and that compost heap of course is going to lead into our next um, part of this video um, a correction of a small but cost, costly error. I'm sure you remember that from oh, last episode or the episode before, I'm not sure. Any event, let's get this compost heap built. Where shall we do it? Now, that was where I thought it might go. Could put it there, but that's just going to be a little bit unsightly. My thinking is this nice bit of flat ground at the back there. So we're going to have to collect the compost from the greenhouses and there will be more greenhouses and fruit trees um, planted in the future and we will then um, pick them up from each greenhouse and put them into the compost heap cover them same as you would with silage and that will um, eventually produce compost nice and easy and of course that would uh, go back into the greenhouses right and then as I said, that leads into the fact that we put up a compost processing silo next to our pigs instead of a manure heap. So we will get some money back from, uh, from taking this down, but there will be a bit of a loss. Well, considering that we have a huge bank loan and not a lot of money, uh, really quite a substantial loss but yeah that's it has to be done the only saving grace is that we get a nice little flat piece of concrete after we've taken this down <laughs> oh dear small mercies as they say right let's get this salt so 12,000 I can't remember what we paid for it uh, I think it was 25,000 so or 20,000 I can't remember we've just put it up and I've forgotten um, any case let's get this built so we'll go into silos get a nice little light I don't want the huge compost heap I just want something that looks looks good here no, I keep on saying compost heap and this is why things go wrong yeah <laughs> it should be manure heap yeah and of course that still not a hundred percent level <laughs> even though we're putting it on the concrete any event not going to stress too much about it there that's done fantastic right so that that's that error co corrected Right, now, I'm sure as you can see to the left of us here, we have um, already harvested and I've lost that whole episode. I'm not quite sure how I lost the file. Well, that's not entirely true. I do know how I lost the file. I was clearing out my OBS um, recordings and I had forgotten to remix the file which I thought I had put into a different folder but I hadn't and I deleted it and of course that was gone forever any event uh, it's done we've missed out on the harvest there were a couple of other little things that we did and I will uh, show you what they are a little bit later in the video in the meantime, we have three fields that are now empty and need to be replanted. 
No, I don't think they need to be ploughed. I think uh, that our cedar can direct drill, so although we're not playing with pre precision farming yet, um, if I do plough, um, it'll take the whole weeding part out of it and um, I want to be able to um, go through the weeding process again in this next um, batch of crop that we grow. So we will direct seed and we're going to plant wheat in all these fields. Wheat is going to be, well wheat and barley are going to be our main crops that we need, mainly to feed the chickens of course. So let's get that all sorted out and we'll get started on one of these fields. We won't show you the whole operation, we'll kind of jump around a bit but we'll get it done. Yeah, so the chickens are going to need lots and lots of um, food, um, particularly as they get fuller and fuller and when we have um, four full pens of um, chicken laying chickens um, it's going to take a lot of um, wheat or barley or chicken feed basically uh, to keep those egg, that egg production going so we're going to plant three fields of wheat um, and of course that will also give us the straw that we can um, that we're going to need for the pigs I'm umming and ahhing so much still thinking about the fact that I've lost that first harvest now with the with that harvest we did we did lease a harvester we leased pretty much the smallest harvester that we could um, and we did plant three trees up on the hill so we did do the right thing yeah still a little bit gutted about that whole little escapade but nobody else to blame but myself i'm just sorry that i couldn't show it to you right let's get going so the weeds have grown already and they will pretty much grow straight back once we've planted but uh, yeah in the next day we will just get the weed out and we'll do the weeding So in the same process, um, I did show you the purchase of the mill in the last episode, and we did get a, it's not a huge amount of pig, pig food, um, I, th I still think we're going to have to look for a, a more sustainable, well not sustainable, a, a more productive form of producing um, pig feed over the next couple of episodes but um, yeah we did get pig food it did cut down some of our requirements for pig food and we um, we got quite a bit of flour we sold some flour into the town and I also built a bakery in which we are making bread and spaghetti or pasta. So that's that first field done. Just get the second one started. And then we've got the big field where we had the sorghum, sorghum, sorghum in the last time. And we'll get that planted in the wheat as well. Uh, the corn still hasn't been harvested yet. Uh, so that's one thing that we should be able to show you so that's the second field done and dusted planted with wheat get up and around oops a little little corner there to be done fantastic right let's get this field started and done yeah so um once i've finished this i'll just take you for a little trip around the back and uh we will um, show you the the bakery as well. The pigs are all doing okay at this stage. 
we've kept him reasonably well fed. It will be a little bit of time before we have be able to generate any income from the pigs in terms of in terms of being able to sell off um, some of the porkers for meat production. I want to try and get um, our pig population up as quickly as possible so that we can get as much manure as possible. We are going to make a lot of new fields which is also in an episode to come. That one I'm pleased to say at this point in time I have not lost. <laughs> but who knows? Who knows? My track record and 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 files, and I think, I, and I always thought I had such a good workflow going. I do really. It's just I make some really stupid mistakes. Anyway, get over it, get over it. Right. So we've obviously going to roll the fields. One of those more mundane tasks. We will. We are trying to do all as many steps as possible. Um, the fields did not indicate that they needed to be ploughed, and they also did not indicate that they needed any lime, so that was fine. So this is just a little bit of a rundown at the end of a day. It is a little bit ahead of time, um, but it's just to show you that we've finished off these fields and I just want to nip around and show you the the bakery or the the flour mill and the bakery right so we've got them at the back here so we've got our windmill going to power the bakery flour mill well once again a huge huge apology for missing out that really really important episode or part of the growth of our farm well that's where i'm going to end that thank you so much for watching if you've enjoyed this little apology video please do like and subscribe and we'll catch you in the next one Cheerio.